I've been collecting fossil shark teeth now for a couple of years and would like to share with you about this educational and fun hobby. What started as just watching people on YouTube digging up or scuba diving for fossil shark teeth has now turned into a collection of quite a few teeth in number representing quite a few species in my collection. My interests and preferences in shark tooth collecting have grown into collecting fossil teeth representing the evolution of the great white shark and the evolution of megalodon. Sharing these fossil teeth with you in this video, I hope that I might tempt you into getting into this fascinating hobby. When it comes to your own personal ethics, wanting to collect jaws or modern shark teeth is entirely up to you. Modern shark's teeth that you obtain that contribute to, or not contribute to the market pressures that increases the threats to modern sharks is your personal choice. It has been estimated that 100 million sharks are killed by humans every year. A tragedy, yes, but again, in the end, it's up to you what you choose to collect or not to collect. A final note to leave you with about this is nearly all modern sharks lineages are at least a few million years old and fossil examples can be found for today's existing species if you know where to look or who to ask. An important thing in a collection, especially a biological one, is to keep records by labeling your specimens. I personally decided early on that this was important to me and applied labels to the shark's teeth as soon as they came into my collection. Each tooth in my collection having a label with the genus of species and where it's from. In your own collection, you can have additional information about each specimen such as how much the specimen costs, the geological stratigraphy it was found in, etc. It is important that your specimens you collect have at least basic information accompanying them or they will end up being scientifically worthless. There are many ways to display your fossil shark teeth. In my own collection, I keep them in a rugged, waterproof plastic case lined with protective foam. A basic and common way to display your fossil shark teeth is in Riker mounts, a little plastic box with a see-through lid and soft mounting material inside. If your collection really gets big, you can opt for a lighted glass display cabinet with some acrylic stands and steps to display your specimens. To go further, you can even add some plastic prehistoric shark models for a visualization of the animals that connect to the fossil specimen. A drawer set for your collection is another way if you want to go compact with your specimens. In the end, your display or lack of one is your personal preference. When you start collecting fossil shark's teeth, you'll find yourself simply collecting whatever you can. As your collection grows, you may want to specialize. What you specialize in is entirely based on what you find most interesting. Specializing could be a particular family of fossil sharks, a particular locality where you obtain your specimens from, or a particular age the fossil shark's teeth come from. Collecting shark's teeth is a great way to learn about the evolution of these fascinating fish, as well as learning about paleontology and marine biology, past and present.
Thank you for watching.